तू मेरा अफसाना तू मेरा पैमाना तू मेरी आदत इबादत है तू तू मेरा मुस्काना तू मेरा घबराना तू मेरी गुस्ताखी माफी भी तू ब्यूटिफुल सॉन्ग मेरी नस नस में तू मेरी जहाँ है और तू मेरी तू इज शांतरमोत्र सिग्नेचर शादी है तू ही दुआ मेरी सजदा भी तू डिस्टिंक्टली रिमेम्बर दैट डे दिया वाज देयर साहिल वाज देयर ड्रेट वाज देयर एंड आई सैंग द ट्यून दे वर हैप्पी दे वर दिस थिंग बट दे वर जस्ट हैप्पी दे वाज नो कॉन्फ्लिक्ट दे वाज नो क्वेश्चंस आस्क्ड एंड दैट मेड मी वेरी अनकंफर्टेबल सो आई इमीडिएटली uh having created what i did i said you know what guys there's another tune that i have it's a little semi classical based i don't know whether it goes with the film or not but just hit it and it did and it's amazing how dia and sal jumped at it muskurate yo hi to when i heard the composition before even the lyrics were written uh, i think we had that on camera it's pretty embarrassing i cried i just couldn't like stop crying because it had such a powerful connection just the tune itself was so haunting and so beautiful my favorite song in the film because it's it's dreamy so you know you have that liberty to go for it it's got a slight classical base it's slightly sophy after a long time i think we heard uh, a duet a love duet which is within the space and uh, i remember shantanu saying you know Uh, guys thank you for letting me compose a song like this because today for some reason we are a little fearful and i said no 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 one is you know when when it's a good song it's a good song when it's a great song it's a great song and nobody with a fair sense of uh, music which i believe we have uh, will ever deny it <laughs> the tune has this ability to haunt you and make you feel things that you haven't felt in a very long time and then swanand kirkere came in and wrote these lyrics that were sheer poetry and then he went and gave the song that much more depth and suddenly the song went to another level zindagi kyun khud hi khud se begani lage maziya चले आओ साहिल एंड शांतनु वे डिबेटिंग हु वी शुड गेट टू सिंग द सॉन्ग एंड इट वाज अ गिवन दैट श्रेया हैड टू सिंग इट बट वी वर डिबेटिंग हु द मैन मेल वोकल शुड बी इन माय माइंड आई न्यू देयर वाज वन सॉन्ग दैट दिस बॉय हैड टू सिंग इन द फिल्म बिकॉज़ आई लव हिज वॉइस आई थिंक ही हैज गॉट दिस वेरी वेरी रूटेड वॉइस classical voice at the same time there's this modern tilt in it iski roo iski awaaz mein jhalakti hai he's just got so much depth in his voice so i recommended his name and they both looked at me sahil and shantanu and they were like that's a good idea the, it's got that classically you know that um, the, those kind of pakiza pakiza kind of space so i was there immediately when i heard the song i was like wow this is a beautiful song So and then they told me that how it's going to be shot. Uh, Bokwan's voice is just so soulful and it just it, it is so masculine and yet it has so much moisture. I think I'm in love with Bokwan's voice. Um uh, I'm going to request him if he could do my voice for, for a long time to come. Ahte kuch nahi si jaagi hai. 
he and I sat down and designed the look and the feel for the song. And we both immediately felt that Anita Dongre would be perfect to execute the garments for the song. We sat on color chart and we've all sort of like taken back something from each meeting, come back with different ideas, worked things around. It's been a lot of back and forth, it's been a great effort, a true team effort, I have to say. Anita Dongre and um, Thea just brought in that dreamlike quality beautifully through the colors, the silhouettes, the accessories. What can I say? I felt like I belonged there, you know, Golconda Fort, Kutub Shahi too. There was, everything was very uh, classical and traditional and that's very me. <laughs> My favorite, 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 favorite space in the song is the Hamam. They had lit about 200 diyas, and Diya was doing that along with Tariq Bhai. Kafi achi mehat ki on hai, aur kafi perfect ra. The compliment could be given to song was by Vidya who said that in life um, when she is no more she would like the song to be played in remembrance of her which I think is a fantastic compliment that anyone can give anyone. It's the soul's imagination of how he would be when he finally falls in love. Everyone always think of themselves as a prince and he sees himself as a prince. And that one girl who he had not imagined to fall in love with, suddenly her transformation almost princess-like. It's a beautiful mix of the actual Bobby and how Bobby would uh, light up because of his love and what he wants to give her uh, in love as well. Just different worlds converging in the song and I think that's what makes it so meaningful and beautiful. It's been one of the songs you wait for. It is actually my favorite. I think it's a great blend. Will the younger people like it? And I promise you, I've made everyone hear every song. And two live songs.